these works embody the very soul of the painter. They are expansive, powerful, and deeply moving. They deserve to be showcased in major art galleries around the world. These are the words of Fernando de Felix, a renowned painter and the president of the National Academy of Fine Arts of Brera in Milan, Italy, describing the work of a Chinese artist. This artist is Wang Gang, currently a professor at Zhongyuan Institute of Technology, a member of the Chinese Artists Association, a director of the Hunan Artists Association, the deputy director of the Hunan Oil Painting Art Committee, and the vice president of the Hunan Oil Painting Society. He served as the deputy leader of the creative team for the oil painting, Jiao Yulu, a significant piece in the national major historical theme art creation project. His works have been featured in various prestigious exhibitions, including the 2nd National Youth Art Exhibition, the 6th, 8th, 10th, and 11th National Art Exhibitions, the 1st and 3rd National Oil Painting Annual Exhibitions, the Chinese Contemporary Painting Exhibition, and the Chengdu Biennale, among others. Wang Gang's art piece, Lao Wan Earth Relief, earned the 5th Hunan Province Literary and Art Outstanding Achievements Award, while his land art, Gaze of the Land, received both the Expert Award and the Public Award at the 2017 20th China Sculpture Forum. In 2022, his land art, Gazing at the Starry Sky, was acclaimed as the most watched work at the Jinan International Biennale. Wang Gang's works are rich in social, contemporary, and historical themes, narrating the grand epic of human civilization through a diverse artistic language. His art delves into the roots and essence of existence, representing Chinese art amidst the great changes in the world. Wang Gang's pieces are known for their high style and refined taste, a testament to his life experiences. As an educated youth who went to the countryside, Wang Gang has endured significant hardships, worked tirelessly, and forged bonds with farmers. Originally named Yen Daochun, he has a profound appreciation for the rich culture and classical philosophy of the Chinese nation. His dedication to his craft is evident, he frequently goes out to sketch, inspired by the grandeur of the Yellow River and Taihang Mountains. He has a deep fascination with the simplicity of ancient art, particularly from antiquity to the Han Dynasty. For over ten years, he studied painted pottery Han jars, producing numerous still-life creations that have left a notable impact on the art world. Wang Gang is indifferent to fame and wealth, often reflecting on the goodness and beauty of human nature, the origins and destiny of humanity, and the harmonious relationship between man and nature. He strives to use his artistic talent to preserve the long history and simple land of the Central Plains, creating timeless works imbued with spiritual depth for future generations. With broad sentiments, Wang Gang eclectically absorbs the essence of both Eastern and Western, classical and contemporary art. He remains focused, works diligently, and has developed a unique style. Although he maintains a low profile, his works are grand and majestic. His amazing artistic creativity often inspires the world, his powerful momentum shocks people, and his simple and strong character purifies the soul. Because of this, Wang Gang's works resonate deeply with people, inspiring them to strive hard and often moving them to tears. His Lao Wan series is a testament to his academic standing. These works have been featured in core journals such as, Art Research, Chinese Oil Painting, Oil Painters, Chinese Contemporary Oil Painting, and Chinese Contemporary Art History. These monographs have gained widespread circulation both domestically and internationally. Many of his original works have been collected by prestigious institutions, including the National Art Museum of China, the China Oil Painting Academy, the Central Academy of Fine Arts Art Museum, the Hunan Provincial Art Museum, and the Shandong Art Museum. His art is also held in various institutions and private collections in the United Kingdom, France, and the United States. According to incomplete statistics, numerous institutions, including Bowdoin College in the United States, the China Academy of Art, the Central Academy of Fine Arts, the Sichuan Academy of Fine Arts, and the Hubei Academy of Fine Arts, have recognized Wang Gang Lao Wan's Earth Relief large-scale performance art as a classic example for teaching Chinese contemporary art. After two years of careful organization and planning, 
the Zhengzhou Art Museum presented a case study exhibition of contemporary local artists titled Wang Gang, Story of the Yellow River, Contemporary Art Exhibition on the Theme of Yellow River. Since its opening, this exhibition has received acclaim from both the industry and many viewers. The works, characterized by their majesty, melancholy, profundity, and loftiness, serve as a spiritual portrait of the people nurtured by the farming civilization along the Yellow River. They also represent a grand epic that embodies the enduring spirit of the Chinese nation over thousands of years. Fan Jitao, secretary of the Xiangyang District Committee of Hugong City, Heilongjiang Province, was deeply moved after viewing Wang Gang's works in the Cloud Exhibition Hall. On April 12, 2023, he traveled to Zhengzhou to meet Wang Gang, introducing the transformation of the coal city of Hugong in recent years. With the established ecological city building strategy and the extensive efforts surrounding this initiative, he sincerely invited Wang Gang to create land art using Hugong century old mines. Wang Gang and his team conducted on site investigations, analyses, and research in Hugong. After more than four months of in-depth contemplation on tracing origins and envisioning the future, and with strong support from the Hugong municipal government, they created an epic-making masterpiece cosmic ecological art, Hugong Eye of the Earth. This piece employs a variety of artistic methods to convey the theme of cosmic ecology comprehensively, transforming Hugong's two open pit mines into the eyes of humanity, where all things are integrated. This allows for the emergence of giants who embody the natural way of heaven, positioning Hagong, a once splendid industrial town, on a journey infused with Eastern wisdom, leading to a rebirth and a future-oriented world. Wang Gang's works are deeply intertwined with his personal experiences, spanning over half a century of diverse challenges and transformations. He spent two years as an educated youth, cultivating crops, digging wells, constructing his own home, and engaging in various construction projects. Additionally, he worked in a factory and spent a year as a manual laborer, providing him with first-hand insights into the living conditions and spiritual needs of grassroots workers amidst numerous social changes. In his past, Wang Gang dedicated several months to living among miners in mining areas and with mountain dwellers in remote regions. Additionally, he frequently ventured into the countryside for sketching purposes. These experiences exposed him to numerous hardships and physical injuries. Consequently, Wang Gang believes that personal experiences profoundly influence the spiritual essence of his artistic endeavors. Every artist likely has such an experience, it is not that life experiences come with ideas first, but rather that one's own growth and experiences indicate the path they will take. For the next Ningjian interview, we will explore Wang Gang's works as a window into his creative inner world.